ट्रांसप्लांटेशन ऑफ ह्यूमन ऑर्गन एंड टिश्यूज एक्ट दर इज अज गैप बिटवीन द डिमांड एंड सप्लाई ऑफ ऑर्गन एज ऑफ नाउ there is a need to promote more deceased organ donations rather than rely only on living donors so cadaveric do organ donation means organ donation through a deceased uh, patient or uh, cadaveric organ do uh, donor transplant can be done by uh, from a brain dead brain stem dead persons before the heart stops beating general background about 1.5 lakh deaths happen annually due to road traffic accidents in india a large number of these cases could be harvested for organs so the organ donation rate in india is less than 1 as compared to the maximum of around 48 in spain so the large number of organ donation takes place in the country of spain and their organization organ donation rate is 48 whereas in india it is less than 1 The organ donation rate has increased to about four times as compared to twenty two thousand twelve, when it was zero point one six. The legal framework, the or uh, the Transplantation of Human Organs uh, Act, TOA, nineteen ninety four, was enacted in the year nineteen ninety four and has been adopted in all the states except erstwhile state of. Uh, Jammu and Kashmir and Andhra Pradesh. As of now, Jammu and Kashmir is not a state; it's a union territory. Uh, the main purpose of the act is to regulate the removal, storage, and plant transplantation of the human organs for therapeutic purposes and for prevention of commercial dealings of uh, dealings in human organs. So they have to monitor these aspects. This act monitors these aspects. the brain stem death is recognized as a legal death in india under the transplantation of human organs and tissues act since 1994 so once a patient is brain stem dead they will be legally dead in the registers after natural cardiac death only a few organs or tissues can be donated like cornea bone skin blood vessels whereas after brain stem death almost 37 different organs and tissues can be donated including vital organs such as kidneys heart liver and lungs so that is the difference between a cardiac death and the brain stem death you can see how many of the uh, organs and tissues can be donated in comparison important amendments tissue have been included along with organs earlier it was only organs the act was only about organs but now tissues have also been included uh, near relative definition is given in this act and they comprise of the parents father mother brother sister grandfather grandmother grandson granddaughter provision of the retrieval centers are there where the organs can be uh, these are centers centers which are uh, which have under the law they can act as retrieval centers and they can remove the organs for harvesting provision of swap donation is also included for example two families who require certain organ donations but their own members can't uh, because of uh, not matching uh, the, the own members cannot give their patients organs what they will do is organ swapping but but uh, but these donors blood cross matching and everything is matching with the receiving end of an another family and their matching uh, their donors are matching with the receiving end of family a they can swap the donations mandatory inquiry from the attendance of the potential donors is done so that they, nobody is coerced into a uh, donating organ provision of mandatory transplant coordinator is provided in all the hospitals registered under the act only few hospitals are registered under this act they can carry out the transplantation so in all these transplant centers transplant coordinator will be arranged from the uh, from the amendment to protect the vulnerable and poor and there is a provision of higher penalties as uh, has been made for trading in organs those who get into the trading of organs by coercing and threatening and Uh, threatening the poor and the vulnerable uh, parties in the society uh, penalties are given under the, this act 
constitution of a brain death certification board has been done. They will certify a certain donor or a cadaver as brain death. National Human Organs and Tissues Removal and Storage Network has been established and National Registry for Transplant has also been established. Uh, there is a provision of advisory committee, committee to aid and advise the appropriate authority. Recreation of corneas has been permitted by the by a trained technician. Act has made provision of greater caution in case of minors and foreign national uh, and prohibition of organ donation from mentally challenged person. They have a special category to be uh, no, uh, to be taken care of here, especially when it comes to minors, foreign nationals, and mentally challenged. Source of the organs for plant uh, transplant, near relative, if it's a living donor, uh, near relative donor, uh, other than near, near relative donors, and by swapping. Disease donor uh, transplantation, donor after brain stem death, and donor after cardiac death. Issues and challenges we face in this area are high burden of organ failure cases, which we have a very less control on post surgery. Poor availability of donor, that is a demand, demand versus supply gap. Lack of awareness of the concept of brain, brain stem, uh, stem death. Sometimes the relatives uh, do not agree that the patient is dead. Even if the heart is beating, they believe that there are chances that they may drive back to life. So that is an, a lack of awareness we have to address. Poor brain stem death certification by hospitals that is the fault in their record and documentation. Availability of infrastructure, especially in government sector, very few government hospitals will come under uh, registered transplant centers. Awareness and attitude towards organ donation for some cultural and some social beliefs, they don't believe in the organ donation. Organ trading, which is a criminal offense, which takes place. Reluctance of many states to adopt the TOHA amendment. Transportation of uh, donated organs, especially interstate transportation, it has to be done. Uh, given to the constituency of our road structure, the constructed, uh, how, how the roads are being constructed in India, how developed, how underdeveloped country are we given to all these factors. Uh, allocation of deceased donors, uh, donor organs, especially to foreigners, uh, special care has to be taken that they are none of the foreigners are charged for organ donation. That comes into the organ trade uh, trading. Gaps in data reporting, especially online entry by hospitals and states national registry, they are not coming up much. Functional organized networking system. Uh, network, all the uh, hospitals involved in this networking system are not as functioning as they should be on paper high cost, especially for uninsured and poor patients. That is most of the citizens in India. Maintenance of a standard, maintenance of standards in transplantation. Thank you.